the sheer elemental forces raging in the vastness of the universe regularly leave us with jaws dropped. Gigantic collisions and explosions occur again and again in space, which differ significantly in terms of their intensities from the spectacles of our blue home planet. Recently, renowned space researchers even succeeded in capturing on camera the most powerful detonation known to date in our galactic neighborhood. What triggered the cosmic explosion, what it looked like in detail, and which future projects will help to better understand the effects of such phenomena, you can find out in the following video. Want to see more exciting videos about the most amazing phenomena in the universe? Then remember to subscribe to Simply Space to stay up to date. Feel free to show us with a thumbs up that we can keep you entertained with our videos. Now let's take a look at one of the most amazing galactic explosions of all time. the most powerful detonation in space. A few years ago, over a billion light years away from Earth, a breathtaking spectacle with a huge effect took place, sending terrestrial scientists into excited action. Never before had astronomers succeeded in observing such a powerful galactic detonation. The natural phenomenon proved to mankind once again that immense forces are in truth inherent in the events of the universe. The origin of this fascinating event was at the same time the last chapter in the life of a star. While the gleaming bright celestial body finally went supernova and transformed into a black hole, the highly exciting event was accompanied by a massive gamma ray burst. Specifically, it was a combination of X-ray and gamma ray flashes so intense that they could even be observed from Earth. The experts at the Electron Synchrotron in Hamburg who made the unique observation, were deeply impressed by the cosmic detonation. With the help of the Fermi Space Telescope and NASA's Swift Research Satellite, the researchers finally achieved a great victory. The recordings of these highly complex technical devices were in turn supplemented by the information provided by the high-energy stereoscopic system. This is a network of Cherenkov telescopes that have been observing cosmic gamma rays since 2002. Although the origin of the explosion was a billion light years away from our home planet, the star was still practically in the backyard of our galactic neighborhood. How important the observation in the constellation Eridanus was in the overall scientific context becomes apparent when looking at the amazing details of this natural event. It seems the detonation possessed the most energetic radiation of all gamma ray bursts known so far. At the same time, it was accompanied by the longest gamma ray afterglow known to experts to date. The relatively short distance between the explosion and Earth allowed scientists to get an incomparably detailed view of the events. By contrast, gamma ray bursts previously observed were an average of 20 billion light years from our terrestrial home. Unparalleled Intensity The first time the sensational burst, which was named GRB 190829A, was discovered was in August 2019. If we follow the explanations of researcher Dr. Andrew Taylor, scientists grabbed a front row seat for this amazing event. Experts were able to observe the intense afterglow of the detonation for several days. The gamma ray energies emitted, in turn, were expected to effortlessly eclipse anything known to date. Meanwhile, the spatial constellation between the Earth and the stellar death made it possible for experts to analyze the spectrum of the cosmic afterglow in detail. In essence, the scientists were looking at the distribution of photon energies in a very high energy range. In the course of the measurements, the researchers succeeded in determining the spectrum to be 3.3 tera electron volts. In other words, this means that the corresponding photon energies were a trillion times more intense than the photons in visible light. This incredible intensity was also due to the small spatial distance between our home planet and the starting point of the detonation. Comparable outbursts in more distant galaxies are always due to the fact that the ejected, energetic photons collide with the background light on their way through space and are partially absorbed. Fortunately, this was not the case with the gamma ray burst GRB 190829A, which, by the way, was only the fourth observed event of this kind. 
the three galactic detonations that had been detected before were, as mentioned, much farther away from our Earth. Thus, the afterglow of the previous events could only be examined in each case for a few hours. Furthermore, these phenomena came with much smaller energy bursts. What mechanisms generate the emission components? According to the consensus of experts, detonations of this kind are among the most intense explosions in the entire universe. When a rapidly rotating star reaches the last chapter of its life, an extreme shockwave is ultimately generated, fed by a part of the released gravitational energy. The corresponding pressure wave can in turn be detected with our terrestrial measuring instruments in the form of a gamma ray burst. This impressive process can be divided into two different phases. While the first promptly occurring phase sometimes lasts only a few seconds to minutes, the afterglow phase, in which the event finally gently subsides, takes considerably more time. In the case of the most recent gamma ray burst, however, researchers came across a remarkable detail that prompts the experts to view detonations of this kind in a completely new light. According to this, past theories still assume that the two components ejected in the course of the explosion were produced by separate, independent processes. However, the striking parallels between the recorded X-ray and gamma ray emissions now shake this established theory. Although the outdated thesis was based on gamma rays being created by a single mechanism, it still seemed unlikely that even the most intense detonations in space could accelerate electrons sufficiently enough to directly cause the gamma ray burst. This, in turn, is due to the natural balance of acceleration and cooling of particles within a given scenario, such as that of a particle accelerator. An important finding. The in-depth analysis of the afterglow of GRB 190829A, which took about three days, led to the finding that both emission components, or in other words, gamma and X-rays, faded practically simultaneously. The spectrum of the measured gamma radiation also showed striking similarities with the evolution trend of the X-ray spectrum. Taken together, the recorded data are a strong indication that, contrary to previously widespread belief, the two emissions were not brought into being by two separate mechanisms, but in fact by one and the same. Indeed, a scenario in which the X-rays and gamma rays are coincidentally produced simultaneously from two different origins and subsequently decay in unison would be extremely unlikely. However, in order to further substantiate the information gathered, other measurement results of a comparable nature are needed. Stefan Wagner, spokesman of the High Energy Stereoscopic System, stated that the hopes regarding this issue lie in the measuring instruments of the following generations. According to this, the more complex instruments of the future should provide the final proof that the bursts of gamma and X-rays have a common origin. And indeed, this could possibly succeed in the foreseeable future. As we speak, researchers are currently working hard to complete the Cherenkov Telescope Array in Chile. Future Projects for the Investigation of Gamma Ray Sources The Cherenkov Telescope Array, or CTA for short, is a large-scale project that aims to significantly expand our knowledge of gamma ray astronomy. For this purpose, the construction of 10 state-of-the-art Cherenkov telescopes is envisaged, which will be arranged in two expandable grids. In the future, Cherenkov flashes in the Earth's atmosphere will be studied in more detail in order to gain important insights into galactic gamma ray sources. Cherenkov flashes are particle showers that are triggered by cosmic rays and last only about a billionth of a second. The two different telescope grids will again look at different regions. While the first grid in the Northern Hemisphere will study extragalactic objects, the second, in the Southern Hemisphere, will focus on potential gamma ray sources in our own Milky Way. In terms of measurement ranges, CAS's Cherenkov telescopes are expected to significantly outshine their aging counterparts. The ambitious project, which involves several international agencies, has already been in the preliminary phase for 11 years. After the planning phase was successfully completed in summer 2014, the prototype phase has now begun. But how does the investigation of gamma radiation actually work in detail? Investigation of Gamma Rays Gamma rays are generally regarded as the most energetic electromagnetic waves of all. Therefore, 
it's not surprising that the origins underlying gamma ray bursts are correspondingly powerful. For example, the fascinating radiation is sometimes produced by particle acceleration, which takes place in the immediate vicinity of black holes. But also, the forces created by incomparably fast rotating neutron stars cause gamma rays. To observe the corresponding emissions, experts use special technical equipment. As soon as gamma rays hit the Earth's atmosphere, they trigger the aforementioned particle showers there, which become visible in the form of blue light flashes. The scientists' state-of-the-art measuring instruments, in turn, are capable of recording the atmospheric flashes and providing important data. Based on this information, the experts can in turn deduce where the corresponding gamma ray burst originates and what energy is inherent in it. Our galactic neighborhood is full of natural particle accelerators that cause the emission of gamma rays. Once completed, CAS will study thousands of supernova detonations, binary star systems, and the like, and probe these stunning phenomena with unprecedented sensitivity. Furthermore, the instruments will also search for evidence of dark matter and thus help to unravel one of the greatest cosmic mysteries of all time. What do you think about the stunning galactic detonation? Write us your thoughts, feedback, and suggestions in the comments. Also, take a look at the other exciting videos on our channel, which you can access by clicking on the images in the credits now. Thanks for watching, take care, and we'll see you next time.